All right, so it's about 10 o'clock right now. We have to wake up at 5 a.m. to catch our flight, but I'm at La Puente to do a short errand. It's currently raining on me right now. I haven't really packed yet. Should probably go home and start packing. A few moments later. Okay, so this ended up being the wrong taco truck, but I'm too hungry and it's kind of late. There's no other places to go for tacos right now, so. See how these are? It's not bad. Tripa's pretty good here. Still not as good as the other taco truck that used to be here, though. These tortillas are just like the uh, store bought little taquerias tacos. The other ones used to do handmade tacos. The asada's just all right. Moving on to my favorite, cabeza. Super greasy meat from the cow's head. Gotta put some salt on this one though. Chorizo. Mm. That was the most random thing ever. So the tacos are supposed to be 150 each. And I ordered eight tacos and it came out to six dollars. Eight tacos, six dollars. I don't know if they screwed up or what, but not a bad deal. All right, time to go back home. Six hours later. Okay, so it's about five in the morning right now. Uh, I went to bed at about one o'clock, so I've had about four solid hours of sleep. Um, time to get ready. I think everything's packed. Just waiting for my sister to come pick us up right now. And then it's off to the airport. You excited? Yes. <laughs> Just got everything in the car. We almost didn't fit all our luggage. We're in this little Civic and we have like three large checked luggages, one carry-on and this giant duffel bag right here. So we can't even see out the back right now. <laughs> Man, am I glad that we're not in that traffic over there. Nah, that'll bluff right out. Oh my god, look at this traffic. self-serve pancake maker coffee machine I think I'm gonna have a little bit of coffee this morning mm. all right
Alaska Airlines, your lounge, so good. Mimosas, so good. Free Americano, so good. Bloody Mary. I don't like Bloody Marys that much, but it's free, so good. Bacon. Hey, yo, don't get hammered before the flight, okay? No comment. <laughs> Who's keeping score? Alright, so I was not planning on getting drunk, but yeah, here we are. So now we have to walk back to our terminal. We're at Terminal 6 right now. That's where the airport lounge was. Um, our flights are over at Terminal 4, so that's probably like a half mile walk the other way. We lost her. Where is she? Hey, where are you going? Did you sleep at all last night? Um, can't say that I did, no. How much did you have to drink today? Um, I've had three Bloody Marys, and it's um, 10.30 a.m. right now. <laughs> they got lost too. They got. They, they got. Good job, Diana. It was you. Can't believe we went the wrong way. Traveler pro tip number one do not get violently drunk in the VIP lounge before your flight. Pro tip number two do not get lost walking over to your gate. Traveler pro tip number three. Never get high on your own supply. I mean Girl Scout cookies. That stuff's addictive. I mean, have you ever seen a Girl Scout eating Girl Scout cookies? Exactly, me neither. Thank you. All right, enjoy your flight. That button auto dims the window. You can chat with other people on the plane. How you feeling, yo? potato salad, Japanese potato salad. I really wish we were on the Japan Airlines instead of the American Airlines flight though. It's a dinner roll. Too bad it's cold. And this is my uh, chicken and rice. I probably should have went with the pasta. This thing looks kind of sad right now. Glass of wine. As you can tell by the cups, I've had um, a couple. Got my old Another beer here stashed away, it's for later. Oh, and almost forgot, for dessert we have a caramel brownie. Diana doesn't like tomatoes, so she's giving me her tomatoes. All right, for the moment of truth, let's open this thing up. Chicken and rice, okay. That's disgusting. It's so sad because I'm so hungry. I have to just eat this. I'm so hungry. I won't let I won't let 
let you watch this anymore. Sorry. Yes. Questioning his life right now. They're so questioning their life right now. How's your dinner, you about as pleasant as a 12-hour flight could be. Maybe not, maybe if you're in first class, it'd be a lot more pleasant, but no turbulence. Uh, got to take a little bit of a nap, which was nice. And I managed to drink my way through the entire flight and not get hung over, so that's a bonus. Mm -hmm. 